Um, we are here with Marlena at the Benidorm Fest uh, Festival. Guys, how did you experience last night? Obviously a disappointing result for not only for you, but for many of your fans. But how did you experience last night? It was amazing. There were a lot of energy on the stage, uh, Palau, and I think we were really, really happy and really proud. Two kids on a stage. To, uh, also, yeah. yeah. To, but it was really, really amazing experience, and uh, yeah, we, we are so glad to, to have him here. Uh, yeah. And so proud. I think it was visible on stage that you're actually enjoying, it. like you were having fun, like you said, a playground. We, we, we For an artist, this is a playground. Yeah, really. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so how how long has this journey been since the beginning, the conception of the song, putting together the production until last night? Well, uh, we started this song a year ago. A year ago, yes. And we worked with Kick Bombo, they are the producers, and in April. And oh, from wow. April to yesterday, we, we've been working a lot, a lot of rehearsals. Uh, we made a... See, uh, uh, Apuesta en Escena, uh, scene, La Apuesta yeah. en Escena. Stage performance. Uh, stage uh, stage performance, sí. Uh, with Javier Pajeo, who is really... Uh, He's amazing. A couple. Yeah, a couple. Yeah. And we, we've been working a lot with our team and, and well, we're, we're so happy with the result. Wow. And for those of our audience from around Europe who don't understand maybe the meaning of the song in Spanish, though they can probably guess from the energy that you guys are giving, can you explain what the meaning of the song is for you? Oh, well, it's a summer the, the love. relationship with the red flags. The other uh, yeah. It's a bit... Sí. Joder, no sé explicarlo ahora. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> In Spanish, uh, <laughs> no, it's, um, no, uh, it's uh, like a, uh, it's a summer love. Yeah, summer love. Summer uh, love. Like Danny Shuko and Sandy and Sandy. Ah, uh, like yeah. like Greece. Uh, yeah, like yeah. Greece. And it was and this was the begin the beginning of a, a story, uh, her story that ends in red flags. Uh, another song, from Marlena, that you can hear in our uh -huh. Spotify. And <laughs> check them out on Spotify. <laughs> <laughs> So this starts with Amor de Verano and it ends in Red Flags. Yeah. Okay, I think we can all relate to that. We've all been there before. Uh, yeah. So what does the future hold for you guys? What is what is next on the horizon? So the next week uh, we we made a soul out in La Riviera. Ah, in Madrid? Yeah. yeah. Oh, fantastic. Uh, and the next one uh, in Apollo, in Barcelona. Yeah. Oh, fantastic. I live in Barcelona. Yeah. Maybe uh, I'll be there. Yeah, okay, so I'll, I'll come and see you. Yeah, <laughs> Thank you. Uh, 2,000 people and a uh, lot of uh, support from our people, our fans. So we are really expecting to be there in, in La Riviera, in La Polo. Awesome. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and so what, what have you learned from this experience of taking part in Benidorm Fest? What has been the biggest learning that you've taken from it? Because it's something different than performing. There's more technology, more cameras, other... Yeah, we, we, things to think about. We, I think I, I've learned that uh, we have to enjoy everything, and uh, uh, and we have learned how to move better with cameras and with, uh, a different uh, to be patient, to be. Um, ¿Cómo se dice trabajar en grupo? Work in a group, teamwork. Teamwork. Yeah. Okay. Very good. So for all of your fans around Europe that you've just found, what is your message to them? Where can they follow you? Where can they see you? Where can they find you? Hope you see you guys in around the world, in Europe, and in the whole puto mundo, vale. Todo el puto mundo. All the fucking world. And you can find us in our Spotify and all the streaming platforms. Yeah. Get streaming Amor de Verano. Amor de Verano. Yeah. Stream, stream, stream. Okay. Okay. Gracias. Gracias. Thank you so much.